Where one plate slides beneath another, molten rock, large quantities of fluids and gases eat their way upwards, creating large irregular chambers. Large blocks may fall in and become partly assimilated. Molten rock that doesn't reach the surface solidifies at depth. Again, erosion selectively wears away the softer rock. The coast ranges of British Columbia and the Yukon have been carved out of huge granite chambers. In the ragged range, you can actually see the contact between the gray granite and the rusty colored rock that once surrounded it. Some much smaller granite bodies have proven to be rich sources of minerals. At Bingham Canyon in Utah, tens of thousands of tons of copper are extracted every year. This pit represents just a small part of the granite body. It's the largest open pit mine in the world, two and a half miles wide, more than a half mile deep. There's over 120 miles of railway track within it.